This project was done by the students Valentina Mazushin and Luzina Mariani Russo. It is about the snow leopard as endangered animal. We hope you like it. That is a real hit in these days. You can listen to it in all their platforms by searching the song name or the album name Face of Love. Wow, it's a really good song. I'm going to look for it. Yeah, I know, but we will have to change the news and something urgent has just been declared. <laughs> Pantera Oncha, better known as Snow Leopard, was declared an endangered animal due to habitat loss, poaching and the impact of climate change. From Bhutan to China, this remarkable species plays a key role as both top predators and an indicator of the health of its high altitude habitat. If Snow Leopard thrive, so will countless other species, as well as the millions of people whose livelihoods depend on the rivet flowing down from Central Asia's mountain. Snow leopards can be found throughout high mountain ranges, including the Himalayas and the Southern Siberian Mountains in Russia. They can also be found in the Tiberian Plateau and across a range that stretches from China to the mountains of Central Asia. They prefer steep, rugged terrain with rocky outcrops where prey can be hard to come by. That's why these carnivores require an enormous amount of space to roam. Male leopards require up to 80 square miles, an area bigger than three Manhattans, while females have ranges up to 48 square miles. The ideal snow leopard habitat is bleak, dangerous, cold and desolate, not most people's idea of a nice place to live, but their habitat provides important resources for local communities, from food and medicine to grazing for livestock, and wood for shelter heat and fuel, as well as water sources for millions of people downstream. The current white snow leopard population is around 6,000, but it's hard to make an accurate assessment as snow leopards tend to live in extremely inaccessible areas and are notoriously difficult to see. Snow leopards' numbers have declined by 20% in the last 20 years. Snow leopards were previously classified as endangered on the IUCN Red List, but were reclassified as vulnerable in 2017. Snow leopards are carnivores that actively hunt their prey, although they will also eat carrion at times. Their most common prey is the Himalayan blue sheep, also called Barra, and a single meal would keep a snow leopard going for two weeks. Though these powerful predators can kill animals three times their weight, they also eat smaller fur, such as marmot, hares, game birds, voles, and pika. Other foods in a snow leopard's diet might include Siberian ibex, markor, Himalayan tar, argali, deer, horse, and camel. About the behavior, snow leopards are shy, elusive cats known for their solitary nature. In order to communicate, they leave markings on the landscape that other, other cats will find. They also scrape the ground with their hind legs and spread urine against rocks to mark the territory or locate mates. Snow leopards are not aggressive towards humans since there has never been a verified snow leopard attack on a human being. Even if disturbed while feeding, a snow leopard is more likely to run away than try to defend the site. Adults are solitary and only interact with other leopards during the breeding season. Snow leopards could with stay with their mothers for at least 18 months. But they may never meet again once they split up and start wandering the vast mountain expanses, 
independently. But that is not the important thing. In recent years, a concerted effort has begun to save snow leopards. Protective areas have been established throughout their range, including sanctuaries in Afghanistan, Mongolia, and Kyrgyzstan. The latter was particularly good news. Kyrgyzstan's mountains serve as a corridor for snow leopards traveling between the northern and the southern end of their range. That said, creating protected areas for this big cat has only helped you so much. According to one study, 40% of those protected areas are too small for the white roaming snow leopards. Leopards have also been strengthening their enforcement against poaching and conservation groups work with others to develop systems to keep snow leopards away from their livestock. Others are building awareness about the important role this big cat plays in their environment. As a flagship species, the snow leopards are essentially a mascot for the entire ecosystem. If they survive, so will many of the other species in their habitat. And that's all for today. I am Luisina Mariani Russo. I am Valentina Masucci. And, and this was Argentina and News. See you in the next assignment. Take, Take care. care. Thank <laughs> you.